Princess and Cheese. Wow, that was great! Mm -hmm. Cheese, when it comes to games, you're number one! Hey, you know, anyone can get this good. No way! So far, I've never seen another pastry play as good as you. Well, I'm not a pastry. I'm a cheese, dude. <laughs> Milk, we don't want to be late. Party starts soon. Let's go. Yes, Master Bread. Party? Oh. What kind are you guys going to? Uh, huh? Princess Cake's birthday party is tonight. Jeez, you want to come with? Huh? Yeah, I sure do. <laughs> 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 oh, I'm so awful at these types of games. Huh? Who is it now? Your Highness, may we enter? Uh, uh, <clears throat> come in. <clears throat> your Highness, uh? every bun has gathered downstairs to celebrate your special day. Uh, but I don't feel good. I think it's fever. Achoo! <laughs> And a cough. I won't be able to make it tonight. But, Your Highness, couldn't you at least greet the public or something? <laughs> uh, it's getting worse. Don't you hear my stomach making sounds like a cheap mobile game? Please leave me to suffer alone. Uh, yes, Your mm -hmm. Highness. Hmm. Uh? <laughs> now time to play. My word, she doesn't think we'd notice her game addiction. Mm -hmm. What will happen mm -hmm. to our kingdom? <sighs> I love that they got the place. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. so the food here rocks! It sure does. Ooh. Uh -huh. <clears throat> Sorry to our guests, but the princess will not be making an appearance tonight. Do enjoy the party, everyone. But the whole birthday party's just for her. Maybe she's sick. Now, Wilk, this is our chance. You remember why we're here tonight, right? Yes, we are here to promote the barber shop. Let's move. It's go time! Yeah! Wilk, wait! You guys are gonna leave me alone? Yep. I need to help Master Bread. Be back soon. Uh, what? <laughs> No fair! What am I supposed to do at a party where I don't know anyone? Well, at least I have my games. Aw, oh, man, the Wi-Fi is super weak here! Looks like the signal must be upstairs. Huh? I found it! Up here, the internet works great! Huh? <laughs> jump! Turn! Turn! Jump! <laughs> Lost that one again. What a hard level. You shouldn't turn wet huh? at the end. Good gracious! How long have you been standing there? The uh. nerve! Hey, I'm not trying to be rude. It's not my fault if your fingers are bad uh. at this game. I mean, who can't even get past stage one? Let me show you how it's done. Uh, what the? What's he doing? <laughs> well, that's amazing. I've never been able to complete that level. Piece of cake, seriously. <gasps> How is he so good at this game? Oh, so muscly. He must do this all the time. His focus is laser sharp. He must be super smart, too. Smart and skilled. The perfect man. Uh, Done! Uh, You're up to level 10 now. What? Already level 10? Oh, Mr. Cheese, you're so cool! Oh? Mm -hmm. uh, what time is uh. it? Already 6 o'clock! I gotta get out of here! Uh, wait, where are you uh, going so uh, soon? Uh, There's a new Donut uh, Ranger on tonight! There's no way I'm missing Donut Ranger! Cheese, please! Cheese! <laughs> he even loves Donut Ranger as much as I do! He's perfect! <laughs> Uh -huh. oh. oh, man, I'll never get past level 10. I bet if Cheese were here, he'd help me beat it no problem. <laughs> <laughs> but I don't know where Cheese lives, and I don't have his number. How will I ever get to see him again? <sighs> All that's left is his utterly terrible smell. Hmm. What's wrong with the princess? <laughs> see? It would appear someone has stolen her heart. What? Stolen my sweet baby's heart? Stealing from royalty is punishable by exile or death! 
No, no ma'am. I mean, she's fallen in love with a certain cheese from her party. She's head over heels and can't focus on anything else. <clears throat> my daughter is incapacitated because of some dumb cheese. That's it. I'll talk to my daughter myself. Oh, my cheese. Dearest cheese. Hey! Uh, oh, mother, what do you want? Sweetheart, how can I help you here? Mommy can make it happen. I just uh, want to see cheese again. Uh, and if I can't... Uh, uh, servants, uh, find this cheese uh, immediately! Your Majesty, I'm not sure where we would even start to look for this boy. There are hundreds of types of cheeses in the world. And there are hundreds of ways to lose your job! <laughs> yes, ma'am. Start a search across the entire city. Sir! So why is the princess looking for a cheese? Dunno. But whoever he is, he's a lucky guy. Whoa! Looking for a cheese who's at the princess's birthday party? That's you, right? Huh? Not me, dude. I don't even know what our princess looks like. Come on, let's go to the arcade. Uh, <gasps> Holy donut holes! They get a hundred million bucks! Who cares? <gasps> Nobody needs that much money. They also get the newest Snackbox huh? One! Snackbox One? Why didn't you say so? See you later! Gotta huh? go! Oh, I don't know why the rest of you are oh, here. Oh, I'm gonna be the winner. Oh, <laughs> is this where the line ends? Just think of all the games I'll play on that new console! I don't feel well these days. Please leave me alone. We've called all the cheeses in Bakery Town to come to you, Your Majesty. You're the only one who remembers the exact smell of the cheese, so you'll have to identify him yourself. Are you sure? My lovely cheese will really come here? I remember it like it was yesterday. I could never forget that pungent smell. Is this the day? Will I finally get to play games with my cheesy game wizard again? Well, bring in the first cheese right away. Greetings, Your Majesty. I'm here for you. Mozzarella cheese, the one and only, at your service, Your Highness. Mm, I don't remember his face being so round. And his scent is way too fresh to be my cheese. Nope. Princess, please wait! <laughs> Why, hello there. My name is Cheddar Cheese. Please experience some of my sharp smell. I'm sure you'll find I'm the one you're looking for. Yum! But my cheese was more fermented. Not so sharp, a bit more gross. Next! I am blue cheese, ma'am! <laughs> Hi! I'm Ricotta! Next! My name is Emmental. Next! Smoke Gouda? Next! Okay. Next! 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 <sighs> oh, will this mess ever be over? Uh. What if I never find my cheese this way? What if he's uh. simply gone? Uh. Your Majesty, please don't give up hope now. You know there's many kinds of cheeses left in the world. Surely you'll find this boy soon. I won't. Oh. It's over. I'm just going to be sad forever. <laughs> Is that you, Cheese? <gasps> My Cheese, this is the smell. It's really you. Princess, I'm the cheese you met at your birthday party. At your service. Uh -huh. Oh, cheese, you're finally here. So this random kid is who she was looking for? People have weird tastes. You're looking lovely today. Uh, cheese, you'll complete level 10, won't you? What? Uh -huh. You wanted to find me just to help you win the game? Yes, of course. You can help me complete the game, can't you? Uh, sure. You're the best, Cheese! Huh? Your skills are so cool! <laughs> ah, I can't believe it! You completed the last level so fast! Cheese, good job! No problem. <laughs> what are you doing now? From the first day, my heart has been beating only for you. I couldn't think of anything else when I saw you playing that game. Please accept this show of thanks from me. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no escaping this level! <laughs> no. 
Your Majesty! Your Majesty! Are oh, you all right? Seize that cheese! <laughs> Nobody tells her no. <laughs> what the donut's going on here? Hello? 911? Yeah. Everyone here is unconscious after smelling me! What's your emergency? Hello? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> <laughs> Wilk became bread. Oh. <laughs> Master Red! Yeah? I'm sorry, but I can't stay much longer. Can you start mine soon? I have to go. Uh, just a moment. Wilk, please do this customer's hair. Me? Are you sure? Yes, you've been here for over a year now. I'm sure you can handle it. Uh, I can try. Mm. Uh, mm -hmm. Can I really manage this? Yes, it's your time to shine, Wilk. Be a real barber. You're all done. Just look! This looks terrible! Sorry, Is man. there a problem over here? Do you think I want my head to have this weird uh, monstrosity? Uh, I came here to have my hair done by you. Uh, right away. Uh, Book it. Uh, please have a seat. Uh, wow! <laughs> I knew I could count on you, Master Bread. From now on, I only want my hair done by you. <laughs> Thank you. Oh. Hmm? That's such Whoa. amazing work. Master Bread's always the best. Uh, <laughs> can I make an appointment? <laughs> Choco can help you with all that. <laughs> <sighs> what a day. I guess my skills just aren't there yet. Please do my hair. <laughs> Me too. <sighs> I wish I could be as good as Master Bread is. Uh -huh. uh, uh, who, who are you? I'm your fairy god dumpling, here to help you. I make wishes and dreams come true. Young Wilk, what do you wish for? Uh, wish for? Speak up, uh, son. I'm an old bun. I can't hear you. I don't know. Let me think about it first. Huh? Something trinket and a bratwurst. Uh, Master Bread is amazing at hair, and I want to be just as good. What? You say you want to be a bread? Wait, no! I want to be good like bread! You want to be a bread, huh? Consider your wish granted, kid. Yeah! Uh, uh, You're welcome, uh, Toodaloo! Uh, that's not what I asked for! Uh, 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 oh, man. That was a super weird dream. Uh, I lost track of time and I'm late! Uh, gotta run! Morning, Choco. Good morning, Wilk. Hang on. Has Master Bread come in yet? Our roof has a hole in it, so we took the ladder to try to patch it up. Huh? A roof? Wilk, <gasps> bring my hammer up here. Okay. Uh, how did our hole in the roof even get here? Master Bread, huh? I brought you your hammer, sir. Oh, thanks. I'll just grab... Whoa! 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 Master Bread and Wilk. Hello, 911. My boss and my coworker have fallen off the roof. Uh, what's going on? Uh, huh? Choco, where am I? Master Bread, you <sighs> fell off the roof. Don't you remember? Earlier today, you and Wilk fell pretty far. Huh? You're so weird. I'm Wilk. Uh, why does my voice sound like that? <laughs> Ah, and why do I look like Master Bread? What do you mean? You must have hit your head pretty hard, sir. It's not that. I'm not Master Bread. It's me, Wilk. Yeah, I'm going to call a doctor in here. I don't get paid enough to deal with this kind of stuff. There has to be some way to make Choco believe that it's me. Aha! Uh -huh. Choco, yesterday you told me that you thought it was Master Bread that clogged huh? the toilet. Uh. And you call him Scrooge McBread because he won't give you a raise. Uh. And he's a crusty old man someone left at the back of the fridge. And you said... Okay, okay, I believe you. Be quiet. 
So you're saying you and Master Bread switched bodies when you both fell? Master Bread, geez, that way. That would've just as good. What? You say you want to? I, I don't want to be middle-aged. Don't worry, Will. <laughs> Master Bread is way older than middle-aged, I'd say. <laughs> what would you say if you were Master Bread? Don't even say <laughs> such things. Huh? Mm. Master Bread, mm -hmm. good to see you up and about. Are we feeling any better? <laughs> you, she's talking to Bread. <laughs> uh, yes, much better. Good to hear. Our office has gotten many calls asking when you'll return to the barber shop. Oh, no. Master Bread, let's hurry back. Uh, I'm sorry to keep you all waiting so long. Are you all right, Master Bread? We heard that you fell off a roof. Master Bread, you can still do our hair, can't you? Oh, this is bad. I can't do this. Yes, you'll just fake it till you make it. Yes, he'll be right with you. Uh, <sighs> I'm not nearly as confident as Master Bread is, but I'll have to make it work. <laughs> is that okay? Is it terrible? <sighs> Why did you have oh. to do this now? I'm sorry. You could have been giving huh? me this haircut years ago. What? Yeah, I've never had such an avant-garde design before. <laughs> you really are worthy of your <laughs> reputation, Master Bread. You're the best. <laughs> Oh, she looks like a reindeer from oh, space. It's like nothing I've ever uh, seen before on this uh, planet. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Bread is the best. He's used to me. Simply astounding. Wow, well, I guess when Bread does it, it works. What's good, Twisties? I'm here with the pioneer of fashion, the one and only Master Bread. Hey, Bread, do my hair too, yo. Okay. <laughs> Whoa, sweet crumbs! Have you ever seen such crazy hair? Make your way to Fred Barbershop if you want a new style, too! <laughs> Bakery Town's favorite barber is making waves. With his unconventional styles, Bread is once again changing the game. What does Master Bread's style say to you? It says he's a genius better than Picasso. He's departing from his classic styles, embarking on adventures in uncharted design territory. It's a delight to behold. Why, Bread may very well be the best barber in all of Bakery Town's history. Now that I'm Master Bread, nobody thinks my styles are weird. They're awesome. This is what it feels like to be a genius. <laughs> Will, how long can you keep this up? Eventually, you'll have to come back as Wilk. You're right. Master Bread has to wake up sometime. Huh? A bread Barbershop? Huh? Yes, I understand. Choco, that was the royal palace calling just now. They want me to do the queen's hair. But what about being Wilk again? Plenty of time for that later. We got some royal icing to work on. That's an interesting choice. It's something I've never done before. Oh. So these insects will reflect the delicate beauty of nature, flying above a sea of chocolate cream. Yes, that's it for sure. And the worms show the beauty of Her Majesty and her friendship with the Ooh. Earth. Yeah, sure of that. <laughs> her Majesty reigns supreme, shining with this perfect hairstyle. I'd say it looks quite fresh. <laughs> My royal duty has never looked this nice. <laughs> 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 What's going on? Why do I look like Wilk? What's happening to me? What's uh, happening is someone's getting discharged today. Oh, and I heard that your boss is doing the queen's hair today. What fun! They're airing it live. Let's check it out. Broadcasting a haircut. What a waste of time. Uh, why is that me? Uh, hang on! Come back! Oh, uh -oh. I heard the queen's going to debut her new hair today. Good thing we have nothing better going on. I hope it's cool. Mommy, how long do we have to stand here? Just a little longer. Huh? Welcome. We apologize for the wait. We are over the moon cake to present you all with the queen's wonderful transformation. It's like nothing I've ever seen before. Once again, Brett has managed to make something so new and interesting. Yet it looks so familiar, doesn't it? <laughs> Mom, why does the queen have poop on her head? It's a giant oh. dookie. <laughs> Hush, son. You want to live in the dungeon? What? Poo? Oh, it does look like poo, doesn't it? There's worms and nuts in it, too. And flies on top. Please be quiet, son. <laughs> I knew I'd see that look somewhere else, am I right? Plus, it probably smells like it. <laughs> dookie hair, dookie hair, yuck, yuck, yuck. Dookie hair, dookie hair, yuck, yuck, yuck. Royal queen, dookie hair. Oh, royal worms. How dare they? I'll send you all to the dungeon. Oh, man, now the dookie's steaming. It must be a fresh one. <laughs> so much 
such disrespect! You, Fred! How dare you turn me into a laughing stock! your highness! You're done! Drag this traitor to the dungeon this instant! Yes. Uh, uh, not me! Stop! Uh, Come back here! Uh, Stop! I've done it now! Look, the needs fiber! <laughs> Excuse me. Out of my way! Look, you've done it this time! Pretending to be me! Uh, uh, wait! Ahem. Did you learn anything, my boy? Uh, you again? That was an awful thing to do! I thought being Master Bread would be awesome, but I just made everything worse! I have to learn to be a great barber, and I'll do it all on my own! Well, I wasn't listening, but I'm sure you learned your lesson, kid. See you later. Bye, bye, bye. Uh, uh, thank you, very God, Dumpling. Huh? Uh, Master Bread, you good? Uh, bread? Choco, it's me. I'm uh, Wilk again. I'm in the right box. Wilk? So everyone's back to normal again? Yep. Speaking of, where did Bread go? Well... Bread, he... That's it! Lock this bread in the dungeon for the rest of all time! Uh, wait, why me? Uh, hey, you got the wrong guy! Help! Help! Strawberry and chocolate. Ah, oh, Romeo, my love. On this full moon, what couldst thou be up to? What perfect lighting I have. It is time for a selfie to send to Romeo. And a one, two... Juliet! <laughs> Juliet, calm down, tis me! Romeo? How comes tear though? Thy strawberry scent draws me, even in the chocolatey darkness of night, my love. Romeo... Juliet! <laughs> Romeo? <laughs> Give me my long spoon, ho! Oh, a chocolate cake! How darest thou come here? Juliet! Father, let Romeo go! Silence, daughter! Please, sire, Juliet is my world! In no world will Juliet and thou be together! Take this villain out with haste! Yes, yes cuz! <laughs> Juliet! Romeo! Oh, Juliet! Romeo! If thou meet'st that cad once more, you will be banished! <laughs> Dearest, not approach Juliet again. I'll rip out thy chips, thou chocolate coward! <laughs> oh, Juliet, if thee and me couldst be together, into the hottest oven or frozen freezer I'd go! Hast thou lost thy mind? The daughter of my ancient enemy! You'll be banished from my house if you ever see her again! That's not fair! Juliet and I are in the truest of true love! Foolish boy, thou hast gone mad! <laughs> Mom! Husband, stay thy foul mood. Romeo, apologize to thy father now. <sighs> it's no matter. The Valentine's Day party is nigh. A fair chocolate maid will find. One right for thee and this family. <laughs> father, I protest! Romeo, please understand. Unless a strawberry cake you're baked anew, there's no world for you and Juliet. Uh, then I'll become a strawberry cake! <laughs> but thou <laughs> shalt not see Juliet again! I wonder this if is I'm the only man who is Indeed, this is Bread Barbershop! I'm certain Master Bread can turn chocolate to strawberry! Then Juliet's parents shall bless our fair union! 98. <laughs> 99, 100. That's the number we'll be taking for Valentine's Day this year. I don't want to be, though. Come earlier next year. But I've brought all the money in my purse. Ugh, money is but worthless without my love. <laughs> Juliet! <laughs> in the spirit of St. Valentine, I'll accept just one more customer. You want me to turn you into a strawberry cake? Yes, Master Bread. Tis the only way, by my truth. Well, kid, not everyone gets to be baked as a delicious chocolate cake. Why are you trying to change? I must be a strawberry cake for Juliet and I to freely love. Without Juliet, even the richest of chocolate cake is poor. Don't cry now. 
Who, who's Juliet, though? <laughs> Juliet, my sweet <laughs> strawberry love. <laughs> but friends, our families are mortal foes. Yeah! Two cake mixes, both alike in dignity. An ancient grudge twixt chocolate and strawberry. These chocolate cowards, this count as ours. Why do the strawberries grow fussy when tis spring no longer? No, but not but a frozen berry. For hundreds of years, our families have fought. <laughs> 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 Huh? Tis bad mm. luck to run into a chocolate cake before the morn is done. I wondered from whence that stench came from. Twas strawberry. Huh? Thou art the color of poop. Comest at me, very brave. Our parents are still old enemies. <laughs> I never saw true beauty till now. I think my strawberries might burst. <laughs> At first sight, Juliet and I fell fast in love. We won't let the feud betwixt our families star-cross our love. Tis tragic, Romeo. Real sad, <laughs> yeah. Please, make me strawberry now. Then Juliet's parents shall finally permit our love. Okay, pal, I'll make it into the sweetest strawberry slice in town. Wilk, bring all my strawberry stuff here, stat! Sir! Mm. Mm. Oh. Mm. When I'm through, you yourself won't know who you are. Are you sure you're ready? Yes, for anything. First, let's take this chocolate topper off. Juliet is my uh. whole life, and this topper gets in the way! Hey, love's barrier, fall away! Uh, that is beyond tacky. Uh, uh, I got goosebumps. Now, time for some strawberry cream. Oh, oh, this pink cream is as pure as our love. <laughs> oh, strawberries, just like fair Juliet's hair. Oh, Juliet, thine eyes at night shine brighter than the fullest moon. <sighs> Will shut this guy's mouth. I can't work here. Master bread, deep breaths, smell all the money Romeo was paying you. Oh, what perfection! Congrats, kid. You're a strawberry oh. cake. Venus, goddess of beauty and true love, sent the great barber bread to renew mine hope once more. Oh, my dear Juliet, we'll finally be together soon. Well, I'm beat. Let's close up. Yeah. What if it's discovered that I'm a chocolate cake? Oh my! My berries are precious too! See, is that with strawberry cream? They recognize me not. Now I must find fair Juliet. Fine. Beg your pardon. Who art thou? Father. What hast thou done? Father, stay thou. I'll tell you. Silence! Thou art the heir of the Chocolate Clan! Now thou art a foul strawberry cake! Uh... Romeo! Mm -hmm. Thou lookst better with all thy chocolate covered! Congrats! Thou art now a strawberry cake! It suits thee well. <laughs> Should have changed before. To marry fair Juliet, now I'm a strawberry cake! Please, sir, let us be betrothed! Thou shalt not! Oh. <laughs> now that thine only heir is turned strawberry, oh. tis kettles for your family! <laughs> Lookest thou not smug, knave? <laughs> Seest who's here. What? <gasps> is thou Ju Juliet? <gasps> Why art thou a chocolate cake, daughter? <gasps> Did he trick you? No, no. I changed to be with my love, Romeo. <laughs> Husband! What hast thou done? You're a disgrace! Father, ow! Oh. Putting strawberry cream on thyself shames us all! Now come! Husband, calm thyself! No matter what thou does, I'll ne'er let you to be with her! Give up! Enough! Please stop, all of you! <laughs> Heavens above, why must you make us suffer so? Let us love each other! <laughs> Juliet, let us away! <laughs> yes, Romeo! <laughs> Stop right there, boy! <laughs> Juliet, together we may leap over any wall betwixt our love! Dearest Romeo, with thee anywhere I will go! <laughs> 
save Juliet from that villain! Uh, bring Romeo back now! Yes! <laughs> Insane youths! Come quietly! Juliet, even death can't take me from you! Romeo, without thee, nowhere I'll go! And now, for the moment you've all been waiting for, time to pick this year's Valentine couple! And this year's Valentine couple is... Congratulations, Romeo and Juliet! They're a chocolate and strawberry cake couple! How delicious! What foolishness is this? Get me down from there! And now, the couple will kiss! Strawberry and chocolate have finally become one! Love does conquer all! Stop this instant! End this! Congratulations! This year's Valentine couple will be given a special gift from the Queen! Who cares for gifts? A brand new sports car! <laughs> Hot nice hands right now! A penthouse in Eclair Estates! <sighs> it doesn't end there, folks. If these two get married, the Queen will give a one million dollar prize! <sighs> I always thought Romeo to be a sweet boy. Romeo's a catch, I do agree. Juliet's truly fair, don't you think it's so? I think so. No one can control who their child loves. It is true! Get married! Get married! Get married! Get married! Get married! Our parents cheer too. I oh. know. Well then, it seems they have finally accepted us. I love you, Juliet. Me too, Romeo. Mm. Wow! Romeo and Juliet get to be happy. It's true love. Love, yeah. Master Brad, you know Romeo and Juliet both wanted to be like the other cake. <laughs> so why'd you change them both? Uh, mm -mm. A true barber always meets the customer's needs. Wow! There was a reason. I thought you were trying to get double the dough for the same hairdo. <laughs> huh. What are you trying to Nothing. say? <laughs> Brandon's visit. <laughs> Good morning. Morning, Master Bread. <laughs> <laughs> There's some mail here for you. Who? Oh, Butter's VIP premiere, Queen Cake's BD invite. Uh, trash, this is all garbage. <gasps> this, this is... Uh, Master Brett, uh, what's the matter? Who's the letter from? Uh, my dad is coming here! It's not good that he's visiting? No, it's uh -huh. not! My father wasn't a regular dad. I came from a well-to-do family that valued reputation above all else. My father, Breton, expected us to live up to the family name. Well, Bredwin, I heard you have good news? Yes, father. I passed the bar exam on my first try. Whoa, oh, my eldest passed on his very first attempt. Congratulations. It's all because of how hard you pushed me, Dad. <laughs> and you, Bredward? I heard you also have news to share. Yes, I was accepted pre-med at the Mayo hmm. Clinic. Oh, oh pre-med at the Mayo <laughs> Clinic. I couldn't be oh. prouder. It's because I got all my smarts from you, Pop. <laughs> I'm so proud to call the two of you my sons. This calls for a toast. Honey, huh? Brett has some good news, too. Really? Mm -hmm. Brett's in a play. He's going to be an actor. Isn't that right, Brett? Uh, mm. uh, yeah, it's a play by Cheesecough, and uh, I got a really big role. A real big part? <laughs> a cactus? Hmm. No. It's, Brad! Uh, You've always been a loaf, but now you're a liar? Uh, when will you grow up? Honey? No lying loaf is a son of mine! Get out and don't come back! Oh. <laughs> mm. uh, 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 Brad! <sighs> He's a disgrace to our family. <sighs> it's been 20 years since I left. And I haven't seen or spoken to my father since. I didn't know you had such a tragic past. 
It's all behind me. I'm all right. Huh? <laughs> Your life must have been so hard. We didn't even know. <laughs> Enough tears, everybody. Let's all show Bread's dad just how much he succeeded. Let's go! For Bread! But you don't need to do that. Hmm. Master Bread, you've got to trust us. We're not going to let you be the pathetic uh, son forever. What? Uh, pathetic? Time for Operation Celeb uh, Bready Makeover. Let's all get to work. Yeah. 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 The train to Bakery Town. Bakery Town is about to depart. Hmm. 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 Where are you headed to, sir? Hmm. I'm on my way to Bread Barbershop. Bread Barbershop? Mm -hmm. The Shangri-La of style? Hairdo oh. Xanadu? The Bread mm -hmm. Barbershop? Uh, yes. Is it well known? Is it well known? Huh? Who doesn't know Bread? He's been Barber of the Year for ten years in a row. It's oh. been my dream to get my hair styled by Bread at oh. least once. Well, all oh. right then. Get your official Bread snacks. Oh. We have Bread Soda, too. <laughs> Is Bread famous or something? <laughs> of course, oh? he's our biggest celebrity. Oh. Hi, I'd love three bread buns. <laughs> sure, three dollars. Bread stickers! I'm trying to collect all 99. Oh. Wow, good oh. luck! <laughs> hmm. Gracious! Oh, Bread really is a local celebrity. Are you going to oh. Bread Barbershop? Oh. There's a special taxi that goes straight oh. to Bread Barbershop over oh. there. A uh, special taxi? Hmm. Hello, sir. Bread's fan hmm. event is starting soon. Uh, a fan event for who? I'm real jealous of you. A hundred fans were picked to meet him and get his autograph today. I wasn't chosen this time around. Uh, a barber signing autographs? Look at his shop. Huh? Fred's yeah, fan club has been in line all day to get his autograph. Sir, wait. Please give this to Bread. I hope it's okay I ask you. Uh, yeah, sure. Whew. Huh? I camped out all night to get his autograph. I skipped my filling appointment to get Bread's autograph today. Huh? huh? Hey, mister! Huh? Cutting won't end well for you! We waited all night, dude! Uh, I'm not here for an autograph. I'm just here to see my son. Who is your son, then? Bread, the local barber, is my son. Huh? You're... you're his father? You sure do look like him. Yeah! <laughs> it's an honor to meet you, Master Bread's dad. What was it like raising a literal genius? I've been bald for my entire life, sir. Pat my head and make hair grow. I'm taking my road test tomorrow. Wish me luck, Poppy Bread. <laughs> but where is my son? Thanks for waiting, everyone. Huh? Master Bread's ready for his fans. Oh, Bread, it's been a long time. I read about your accomplishments, but I didn't expect you'd be a celebrity. Hi there, Dad. My assistant told me you might be visiting Bakery Town. Have a good stay. Choco, mm -hmm. book him a five-star hotel and his own personal limo. Uh, sure. It's your first time visiting me, so why don't I give you a little tour? <laughs> These are the awards oh. and trophies I've won. Oh, that's a lot of trophies. There's a trophy room in the basement if you want huh? to see more. But that's not all. Oh. Queen Cake, the princess, movie stars, rock bands, my magic hands are in high demand by everyone. Yeah! <laughs> Master Bread! Master Bread! <laughs> Mr. Bread, problem! The train workers took all of our bread boosters down! I heard that the train your dad's on arrived already! What if he finds out about Operation Celeb Bready Makeover? Uh, oh, by the way, who's a toast? He looks just like you, except old. <laughs> 
You tricked me! After all these years, you haven't changed one bit! Lies, lies, all of them lies! When are you going to grow up? No lying loaf is a son of mine! I don't ever want to see you again! Even if I were a real celebrity, nothing I do would ever make you proud! You never treated me like your son anyhow! <laughs> Master Bread! Master Bread, please don't go! 20 years, and you're still up to no good! That doesn't look good. Let's beat it, quick! No, come back! Here's your tea. Thank you. <sighs> Brad only did all of that so you would be proud of him. Please forgive him, Pops. I'm the one you should be mad at. Mm. <sighs> Actually, I'm the one who should be apologizing. Huh? Years it's been, and it hasn't gotten easier to do. Mm. 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 This is what? an album of Bread's childhood memories. Uh -huh. When he comes back, please make sure he gets it. Uh. Well, goodbye. Uh. Huh? Mm. Mm. Album? Memories huh? from Bread's childhood. Huh? Ah, <gasps> what's this? Uh. <sighs> Master, Master Bread! Bread! <laughs> Knew we'd find you here. I'm so sorry, it's all my fault. This is for you. Huh? What's this? Before he left the shop, your dad said to give this to you. Huh? What is this? Uh, An album? No thanks. Please, Master Bread, just take a look. You've got your dad all wrong. Huh? Uh. Uh. He made this for me. Your dad loves you more than anyone else in the world. He came here today to make everything right between you two. Master Bread, it's not too late, you know. Hurry before his train leaves town. <laughs> oh, sweet Juliet, tis thanks to Bread the Barber. If it weren't for bread, wouldst our lips have met uh -huh. this Valentine's Day? Oh, my Romeo, you kiss by the book. Tomorrow's my interview. Oh. I'm nervous I'll blow it. Make an appointment oh. with bread. Oh. Oh. You'll style your hair just right. Ah. Oh. <sighs> I wish I could have apologized to bread. <sighs> Dad! Huh? I hope I haven't gone stale. Dad, it's me, huh? Bread. Bread? Uh, Dad, my please. son. Uh, 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 uh. My son. Dad, oh. come back. Oh. Oh. Bread. I'm sorry, son. Oh. Hmm. Dad, I, I love you. <laughs> Mm. Hey, Mom, that man's crying. He is. Must have left his bag on the train, Munchkin. Oh. Wilkes Awakening. Well, get a load of this. The place actually looks clean for a change. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Huh? How did it get to be noon? I'm late for lunch, but hmm. I promise I'll be back soon. Oh, okay. <laughs> Needless to say. Huh? <laughs> Sorry I'm late. Dude, I've practically expired. Ever since we were pine size, Wilk's always been late. <laughs> That's sure true. All right, now let's spill the milk. What are you up to? I work at Doe's for Donuts, and now I even get to do perms. Oh, sweet. They let you do perms? Turns out I'm very good. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm working at an alternative salon, and I like to style with whipped cashew cream. No surprise there. Whipped cream was always your specialty back in school. Of course, of course. <laughs> well, you can find me at Hot Coco's Barbershop. I'm well on my way to lead stylist. 
I always knew you were the creme de la creme. Wow, incredible! <laughs> oh, you know, it's no big deal. Anyway, Woke, what are you up to these days? Yeah, did you find a job? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I work at a barbershop, oh? too. Oh, no kidding? What's your specialty? Perming? Creams? Mm, it's cleaning. What? <laughs> <laughs> That's perfect! <laughs> Did our professor always say you'd be better off sweeping the floor? <laughs> <laughs> if you haven't aced the art of styling by now, it's maybe time to move on. Huh? That's right. I think it's high time you find yourself another job. Uh, another job? Let me ask you this. Has your boss ever encouraged you to work on your styling skills? Puff faster! Scrub like the wind! You're wasting my time! You know, now that I think of it, he hasn't. Of course he hasn't. He didn't hire you to be a stylist. He hired you to clean up. You've got to open your eyes and do exactly what I say. Master Brad, I'm back. Mm, I see. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sir, may I ask? Mm -hmm. If your boss says, well, someday soon, perhaps, then you're doomed. Master Brad, when will I get to mm -hmm. style hair? Oh, someday soon, perhaps. <laughs> It's just what Chocolate Milk said! And if he gets mad, there's little to no chance he will ever promote you. Mm -hmm. Master Brett, uh, you're planning to make me clean the shop forever, aren't you? Uh, you are giving me a pretty! Now don't just stand there, sweet! So it's true! I'm never going to be a stylist! <laughs> You've killed my dream! Uh, huh? Huh. Master Brad never intended to make me a barber after all. Maybe it is time to move on. What? The barber has no idea when he'll arrive? Yeah, he said he's on a wild moose chase, so he doesn't know. But everyone's waiting to get their hair done now. What to do? Huh? Hmm? <sighs> Excuse me, haven't I seen uh -huh. you before at Bread Barber Shop? Yes. Isn't Bread Barber Shop the most famous salon in town? Mm-hmm. I've seen him working there oh. through the window. Hello, oh. hello. Mm -hmm. We work as volunteers at the community center, mm -hmm. where we look after less fortunate moldy breads. They look forward to hair day all month long, but it seems the barber is running late. Do you think there's uh. any way that you can do their hair instead? Oh, but I'm only an assistant. Well, uh. I bet you're great if you work in that shop. Please say you'll help us out. Look, it's Will. Huh? Hmm? Huh? What are you doing here? Uh, they asked for my help with a hairstyling session. Mm -hmm. <laughs> You're asking Colonel Wilk to style a hair? <laughs> Why would you settle for Wilk when you can have us? Uh, okay then. Maybe you can all help. We'll show you what real style looks like. <laughs> Here we are. Welcome. This is where the moldy breads spend their time. <gasps> This is definitely not what I expected. Mm. You can uh, sort that again. Will we turn moldy if we touch them? You seem surprised, but don't worry, I assure you. These harmless molds aren't contagious at all. It's just that mm. no one wants to cut their hair because of how they look. Please say yes and give them a haircut mm -hmm. they'll never forget. I'm always up for a challenge. Huh? Hmm. Ah! <sighs> but not this one! <laughs> Never unsee that! What? But you didn't even do anything! So it be it! I've got this! Behold! The virtuoso with his whipped cream soy nada! Ah, it's laying unevenly because of the mold! You've left me no choice, but I will wave my pride aside and save the day! Huh? <laughs> it's chocolate time! What is this? It's grabbing my scissors! Huh. <laughs> really a job unworthy of my skill. <sighs> Wilk, I guess that leaves you to give it a try. Oh, me? Oh, you don't want Wilk. Yeah, he finished last in school. What if I fail just like in school? I don't want to make the molds feel even worse. Take these. <gasps> if you give up before you try, you'll never know what could have happened. Fortune favors the mold. <laughs> Are you a milk or a mouse? Oh. Uh. Hmm. Milk! Ugh. I have to find a way to remove the mold. I don't know why you're making huh? such a fuss about this mold. Just use a huh? pair of tongs and get the job done! Huh. Right, huh? I'll use the method that Master Bread taught me. Hey there, might you have a pair of tongs? Huh? Tongs? What on earth? 
He still thinks he's cleaning. Here you go. Did you see that? He got rid of all the mold. Beginner's luck. The art of the mop. You have to apply enough pressure back and forth in order to clean the floor properly. Shine the mirrors. If you wipe the mirrors using a circular motion, you'll end up with a streak-free shine. Brushing. Use a delicate touch. Sorting. Always keep things in order. That's amazing! Wow, that was incredibly cool! You're amazing! I can't believe you ever doubted yourself! Oh, please style uh -huh. my hair! And mine, too! <laughs> now everybody, wait your turn! Yeah, what's all the fuss about? So we can use a pair of tongs! Yeah, and he's nothing more than an assistant. Yeah, that's true, but... Aren't we just assistants? <laughs> You're right. <laughs> Wilk, you must be tired. Why don't you take a break? Oh, don't worry. I'm fine to keep going. Greetings, all. <gasps> I'm sorry I'm late. <laughs> Sir, you finally made it. Indeed. Huh? Uh... Oh, did you style their hair in my place? What a hard-working young fellow. <laughs> oh, you're Master Bread's teacher, aren't you? Hmm, you must be Bread's new apprentice. You've done him proud. Now get some rest. My apprentice will take over for you. <laughs> Showing off. Wilk, allow me to introduce to you my best student, Melon Bread. The Barber's Apprentices. Welcome to Bread Barber Shop. Choco, let's get a move on. Sure. Where on earth did Wilk go and what's keeping him so long? Mr. Bread! Uh, Wilk, you better have an explanation for this. But, sir, look who I've brought with me. Fred, it's been quite some time. Huh. <laughs> Master, what a pleasant surprise. Hmm. Well, I had some errands to do in Bakery Town, you see. We huh? met Moldy Breadberg and I brought him here. <laughs> <laughs> well, everything seems to be in order here. <laughs> well, of course, I was taught by the best. <laughs> oh, who might this be? Allow me to introduce my new pupil. This is Melon Bread. How do you do? Mm. Your new pupil? Mm. After I handed my shop over to you, I mm. decided to take some time off. Mm. Huh? Ha! Ha! Ah! Again! <laughs> <laughs> me too, me too! Hey, she's not finished with me! Oh, I couldn't ignore such raw talent, so I decided mm. to teach her. Wow, what a story! Your talent really did blow me away. Hi there, my name is Wilk. Um, I think we should be friends. Uh, hmm. Huh? <laughs> Talk about a cold melon. That's how kids are these days. <laughs> I'm afraid I'm a bit peckish after the trip. Oh, of course you are. <laughs> Don't worry, Master. We'll make you a feast fit for a king. <laughs> I'll grill up some meat. And I'll fix us something to drink. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what a pleasure to see you and your shop so successful. <laughs> it's all thanks to your teachings. By the by, I was quite impressed with your assistant. Why, he turned those super molds into supermodels. Who will? Cross knows I've tried my hardest to teach that milk toast. Hmm. In that case, why don't we let Melon Bread and Wilk have a hair battle? Huh? Uh, Melon Bread has journeyed from town to town, training to be the best barber. And I suspect this battle will teach them both something. Well, <laughs> still, with no time to repair. Uh, I'd love uh, to. I mean, uh, I have a ton to learn from Melon Bread. Uh, uh, Wilk! Swell, <laughs> we'll meet you tomorrow in the empty parking lot. Until tomorrow, then. Have a nice evening. See you tomorrow. Oh. Mr. Bread, are you all right? By the way, isn't uh. Melon Bread something? Oh. I got to see her uh. in action, and she is a genius. Oh. <laughs> oh. Hmm. All right. Shall we let the battle commence? Yes, huh? I think I'm ready. Hmm. Yes. For the first round, you will carve the coconut. Huh? A coconut? Mmm. 
A true barber can turn solid rock into living art with their very hands. The mm. first to finish their art carving into the coconut wins the round. Ready, set, begin! How am I supposed to carve through this hard shell? Hmm... Huh! I'll use this instead of scissors. Yeah, let's do this! Who uses scissors on a coconut? At least I'm using my melon. Huh. Hmm. Oh, she drilled a detailed carving into a coconut in a matter of minutes! You've done very well. I'm honored, sir. <laughs> For gluten's sake! Oh, uh, Wilk! Carving a coconut with a pair of scissors? Can't you do anything right? Uh. And the winner is... Melon bread, of course. <laughs> Wilk, my boy, why did you use the scissors? Well, of course I knew it would be easier to use the drill. But when I pictured the coconut as a customer's head, <gasps> I couldn't bring myself to carve it with a drill. <laughs> oh, so that's why. All right, enough dilly-dallying. For the second round, chocolate syrup hunt! The first to bring back a warm, fresh batch of chocolate syrup will be declared the winner! What? Huh? But I'm a stranger to this neighborhood. I don't know where to begin to find it. Uh, hmm? I think I know huh? a place. Let's go huh? together! Oh. Uh. Here it is, the best mm -hmm. chocolate syrup factory in Bakery oh. Town. Oh. Mm. Good afternoon to you, sir. Hi there, <laughs> Wilk. Sir, mm -hmm. might we get a freshly made, piping hot batch of chocolate syrup? Oh, what sticky timing. You see, it's lunchtime now and everyone's on their break. Just oh. hold on for a little bit. I'll be back soon. Sure, have a nice lunch. Their chocolate syrup is made from 100% pure. <laughs> <laughs> oh, melon bread, what are you doing? There's no time to waste. Wait, I'm going to grab a batch safe. myself. <sighs> <sighs> Let's do this. I've got it! Wilk? Did you fall in? Trying to save me? I'm so sorry! Huh? Wilk? I'm okay. I'm a milk carton so I can float. Now you go ahead. I'll catch up soon! Huh? Hmm. Looks like I made it. <gasps> Melon bread. I can't believe that you waited for me. No one's gonna say that I cheated my way to the top. Huh? You can play it cool, but I can tell you've got a warm hmm? heart. What? Hey, you can stand there and keep babbling, but I'm out of here. <laughs> Wait for me. <laughs> Hey, Master Bread, we're back! Huh? At the same time? And what took you so long? <laughs> Funny story. I was clumsy and fell into the syrup barrel. Oh, why am I not surprised? In that case, huh? we'll have to call this round a draw. A draw? Does that mean I won? No. The last ah. round will determine who wins. The ultimate feat. The 100 tier what? fruit tower! 100 tier fruit tower? Impossible! The first to make a tower with 100 Ooh. tiers wins the match! Let the final match begin! In order to build a tower that tall, I will start with the largest fruit at the base! Huh. Hmm. Well, watermelons, it's you and me! Cantaloupes above them. And then, the pineapples. Melon bread seems to have a great hmm. stacking tactic. Hmm, indeed. Uh, looks like I'm going to take this home. Almost. Huh? Oh, no! Huh? Oh. oh, my head. What in the gluten was he thinking? Oh, you imbecile. Hmm? You had no tactics. No wonder it <laughs> collapsed. Hmm. Uh. <sighs> Huh. I completed the task. I can't believe she completed it so quickly. Astonishing. Mm -hmm. A job well done. 
Quilk, hmm? you can come down. The match is over. Uh, already? Let's have a look at Wilk's tower, shall uh. we? What am I even looking at? It has no tears. It has no shape. Did you have any plan at all? Hmm. I hereby declare the winner is Melon Bread. <laughs> Nitwit, you didn't even win a single round! <laughs> I'm sorry I let you down, sir. Tomorrow we're going to start back at square one! Sir, I'll try my very best, sir! Red, mm. you keep taking good care of the barbershop. I will, sir. Hey, Melon Bread, congratulations on winning! <laughs> you were a worthy opponent. I'm going to work so hard so I can challenge you again next time. Does that sound like a deal? Hmm. Hmm. That sounds like a good deal to me. All right, now, we'd better go or else we'll miss our train. Uh, have a safe journey, you two. <laughs> Bye, Melon Bread. <laughs> well, now that you've battled Wilk, how do you measure his skills? At first, I thought he was just a clumsy, inept milk carton. But then I realized what a fair, kind heart he has. Still, I'm not very sure hmm? he'll ever be a real barber. Hmm. Are you sure? Huh? Unlike you, Wilk didn't use a drill in the first round. Instead, he used scissors because he thought of that coconut as the client's head. But, but that... And then in the second uh, round, as you know, Wilk was kind enough to help out his opponent. Uh, how did you know? <laughs> There's no way you would have chosen to return together. <laughs> For the last round, Wilk could have finished quickly by stacking the fruit as you did. But it took him longer because he was trying to come up with a meaningful design. Here, take a look. Huh? That child was making a 100-tier statue. The outcome of the match isn't what's important. It's how you respond afterwards, whether you win or lose. You won this battle fair and square, but I'm curious to see who wins next time. <laughs> Time to go! Ooh. Master Pen! Uh, 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 you waited for me uh, all this time? Uh, You're the best! Um, I wasn't uh, waiting for you, I just dozed uh, off. Master Fred, uh, wait for uh, me! Here uh, I come! Uh, <laughs> <laughs>